Hello. Hey, good morning. Is that Mr. James Upcott? Yeah, yes, you can. Good morning, Mr. Upcott. My name is Dr. Tom Baffer from the Hereford County Hospital. Uh, uh, hi there. Is it to speak to you for a few moments, please? Yeah, can you give me one minute? I've just got to go out the building quick. Certainly. Oh, yeah. Let me say I can. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm um, sorry. Mr. Upcott, uh, I wonder if, if I could just uh, talk to you for a few moments. It's with regard to an operation carried out uh, by Mr. Cook and my colleague last September. Am I speaking okay. to the correct Mr. Upcott? Yeah, James Marcus Upcott. That's it, and at 19 Kirkland Close. Yes, yes. Mr. Upcott, there seems to be some sort of problem with that operation and in the fact that the pins that were inserted are actually beginning to splinter. And okay. the pins could cause a thrombosis if they're not replaced. Are you with me so okay. far? Are you having um, any, any problems with pins at the moment? Um, I mean, the only problem I've noticed is that um, I can, like, feel it. Um, you know, I can feel a pin. If I touch my leg, I can feel one of the pins. Right. Is there any tenderness or any swelling or any redness? Uh, no, not really. I mean, I've started doing physical activity on it as well. You, you, um, sorry, you've started doing physical activity? Well, I've been, yeah. I mean, I've been, you know, jogging. Well, I mean, I asked... I mean, I've got li real little information, to be honest with you. Let, 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 me stop you there. let me stop you there, Mr. Opp. You should not be jogging for at least six months. Uh, I mean, when did I have the operation? In September. September, October, November, December. Yeah, I mean, that is, that is, that is six months. Right. And well, how long ago did you start jogging? So I started in March, which is when I was advised okay, by, that, that, by, that, that, by, the, that's fine. But by the doctor. Let me, let me just, let me just uh, clarify a couple of points. On the very rare occasion, these, these pins do in fact splinter, and they may cause a thrombosis if they're not replaced. Can you tell me, what's a, what's a thrombosis? Sorry. It's uh, a localised uh, infection in the skin, which will cause the skin to erupt, and septicemia may well set in and travel up into the bloodstream. Okay. No. If that happens, a blood clot can form. And okay. If, I'm not sure that you're aware that deep vein thrombosis is a fatal side effect of any sort of blood clot. Okay, okay. Now, what, what has happened, I believe the pins that were used in your operation were for gentlemen taller than five foot two. Oh, now, bloody hell. Am I, am I correct in saying that you are above five foot two? Uh, I mean, uh, my, I'm probably about five foot six. Right. I mean, what, what's going on here? I mean, you got, have you got my right details and stuff here? I think so, yeah. Basically, I mean, what, what, shambles. Well, basically, yeah, there has been some sort of, uh, well, I'm not saying an accident, but, but the, wrong well, pins seem to have, on, the wrong pins seem to have been inserted into your leg. Oh, so what we're prepared God. to do, at no cost to yourself, yeah, it's we're, prepared, so we're well. prepared... We're prepared to replace these pins. Now, the question is, would you like us to increase the length of the pin, or are you happy with your five foot six? We can make you five foot eight if you wish. I don't understand. I don't really, I don't really know what... I, I mean, what do you mean five foot... Six? I mean, as far as I'm aware, it's just a, it's just a pin. I don't, you know, I don't know anything about this. No, oh, no, no. The new technology is the fact that we can increase the length of your leg, therefore increasing your overall height. If you were to replace the pins with slightly longer ones, would, would that be something you're interested in? I'm going to have to come in and speak about this because I just haven't got, you know, I haven't got a clue what, about any of this. Okay, well, I'll give you my number. Um, my name is Mr. Mr. Tam Dafer. Tam Dafer. Ta Tam Dafer. Dafer. Yeah. Okay, how do you spell that? That's her name. It's no, one, no one in the hospital seems to know who you were. Uh -huh. It's T-T-A-M. Tam. T-T-A-M. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's your first um, name, yeah. D A Y D A Y I F E R R. All right. Um, I mean, can you drop can you drop me an email? Because I need your contact details, really. Absolutely. If you give me your, your email address, uh, Mr. Opka, I'll do that right away. Okay, it's, uh, are you ready? Yes, go ahead. It's uh, James J A M E S E S dot 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 
U-P-C-O dot net. Dot net. Yeah. Okay, well, I've, I've got your email address there, Mr. Upcott, and like I say, we are prepared to reinsert the pins should you decide to go ahead with the operation, and you can have the slightly longer ones, which will make your own ball structure slightly taller. Okay, I mean, yeah, I'm going to have to come in and see, I, I need someone there with me that understands all this as well. Absolutely. I don't understand this on a phone call, to be perfectly honest. Okay. Okay, well, we'll be in touch, I'll drop you that email right away, Mr. Upcott. Okay, and, I mean, when, uh, when am I going to need this operation? Probably tomorrow, tomorrow, the day after. Um, oh, fucking hell. Oh, there's I mean, use that language, Mr. Upcott. Sorry, sorry, I mean, it's a bit of a shock, like, you know? Well, I, 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 well, I, I, well, I did tell um, you then, then perhaps it comes a shock when the, when the people intrudes through your feet. Um, oh, God. I, um, so I meant, well, I meant to be going, I meant to be away, uh, tomorrow, until, um, Oh, I'm Sunday. afraid that will not be possible, Mr. Upcott. You will have to come to the hospital tomorrow. Okay, uh, so that's to be, uh, okay, that's, that's fine, that's to be done, that's to be done. Um, I mean, how long am I going to be off work and stuff? Probably four months, five months. You're joking me, aren't you? No, sir, I don't think it's a joking matter, no. What you, what you can do, perhaps, is uh, speak to Mr. Matt Faraday, and perhaps he'll let you know what's going on. Enjoy your tour. Yeah! <laughs> Who's this? See you later, James. Bye-bye, mate. Who's this? Who's this? <laughs> Who's this?